Last topic in this large module dedicated to queries is regex operator. I am sure that you are familiar with regular expressions and have used them before. So let's look how you can use regex in MongoDB. In MongoDB, you can find documents not just using exact values, but also using regular expressions that match part of the values. Syntax is following field name, then regex operator, and then pattern with options. Pattern is usually placed between slashes. Options may be placed immediately after the pattern or separately using options operator, like in second line. Let's look at the examples. In the first example, we are looking for city field name using regex tone. Somewhere in the city field value must be combination of three characters tone. After the pattern, you see an option i. Option i means that search will be case insensitive. Second example regex, then ad, and options i. In this case, options are placed in separate operator. And in the regex, we are looking for ad, but results must start with an a and end with a d. It means that we are looking for exactly a d value, but case insensitive. And in the last example, we are looking for state, which value includes somewhere two letters, ca. And this regex is case sensitive. In this course, we will not dive deeper into regular expressions, because it is a large separate topic. Let's look at some examples. Let's open person's collection, place find on the next line, and let's find, for example, persons which name have some characters. So let's add regex operator here, colon, and let's place regular expression between slashes. And let's suppose I am looking just for combination of three letters, R, E, L, and just closing slash and option I. It means that regular expression will be case insensitive. And let's execute it, command enter. And here are results, let's switch to table view. And just nine persons matched, and each name here has R E L combination of letters. So here it is, here it is, and so on. Okay, let's switch back to text mode. I can place options after the comma using separate operator options. And in this case, I need to place options between quotes like this. And let's replace rel with a u r and execute it. Let's switch to table view. In this case, seven documents matched. And here are results. If I will remove options i from here, just like this, and execute it, only two documents match. Because now request is case sensitive. I can add start sign and execute it now. Now, same documents match because they start with those three characters. And last option, you can just use quotes instead of slashes, like this. Let's execute it. So, same result. Let's switch back to text mode and summarize. Regex operator in MongoDB is a very powerful instrument. It allows to perform different types of searches using regular expressions. But please note, that regex queries require significant resources on the server side. Because such queries don't use indexes. We will talk about indexes later on. This lesson concludes large module dedicated to MongoDB queries. And after the pause, we will start updating documents using such methods as update, update one, update many, replace one, and so on. So, see you after the pause. Bye.